If you link to YouTube videos in your course, you must closed caption them. YouTube does not pro does provide closed captions, but they're usually not 100% correct. So the closed caption creation tool will allow you to easily create this closed caption file that you can use with the YouTube closed caption wizard. So before you begin, one of the most important things is that you have already have closed captioned your um, or created the captions in a separate program. In this particular case, I used Word and I just went in and listened to the video and there is no magic way to create these captions. You have to type them in. The thing that's important is that you keep each line to less than 80 characters and make sure there is a hard return at the end. You need to have that file before you begin using the closed caption file creation tool. <clears throat> so you're going to go to the closed caption file creation tool and then what you're going to do is navigate to the YouTube video that you wish to use and create the captions. You're going to copy the URL but here's an important thing. You want to make sure that when you copy the URL to your clipboard you copy everything before there is an ampersand. So here's this ampersand right here. So I don't want to copy this ampersand feature equal u2.be. Uh, I want to go ahead and just highlight from before the ampersand all the way over and go ahead and copy that to my clipboard. I'm going to go back to the, uh, to the uh, closed caption file creation tool and within the YouTube address text area I'm going to paste in that URL and I'm going to click the load video button. If the video does not load then there's probably something wrong with the URL that you copied and you must go ahead and try to figure that out. Now what I'm going to go ahead and do is open my uh, editor that I have my closed captions in. I'm going to highlight them all and I'm going to oops, I'm going to go ahead and copy that to the clipboard. I'm going to go back into the closed caption creation tool and in this area that says uh, paste contents of clipboard below I'm going to go ahead and paste that in. I'm going to click the radio button next to video transcription and I'm going to click load. When you do that you'll notice that they all go into a separate area and there is a start and end time. So now what you need to do is go ahead and start up your YouTube video. As you listen to the video, you're going to click on this insert caption time here. And in the SRT code area, you're going to see the code starting to be built with timestamps on it. So I'll go ahead and get started. And I click the insert button area. And I keep going until this is complete. Now I'll have upbeat music going. And you'll also see right here where the caption will be. So as we get through the music. So you can see as I click on insert caption it automatically puts a start time and an end time and creates this file for you. So you want to go ahead and repeat this process until you have all the captions done. The next step is to click the copy SRT code button. You'll hear a sound and it's copied. You next want to go into a text editor in this case and the best case is using notepad and I'm going to go ahead and paste that code into there. If I want to see what it looks like I can do a word wrap and that's what it looks like. I'm going to go to file and I'm going to click save as and in this case I'll just put it on my desktop for easy use and you just name the file whatever you want and go ahead and save that. This is the file that you're going to need to use with the YouTube closed caption wizard. 